Alrighty. Is this working? I, I hope so. Hey everybody, it's Joe. What y'all staring at? This? Yeah, I'm working on a winter coat. We'll see how it goes over the course of the rest of November. But I'm banging out this video fast and dirty and just getting it out there because I saw this morning on the web on Dominic's Hackerspace blog that he's putting out a make Vember challenge. In the month of November, make something every day of November. And this is November 1st. Now, I wanted to get this video out earlier, but there were a lot of problems that stopped me from being able to do it. I, this is like take 10, and this one I'm just streaming straight to YouTube, just banging out. If this works, great. If not, this is like perfectly in line with make something every day November. Now, I will say that I'm making a slight modification and I'm taking Sundays off because I feel it's important for me to take Sundays off. But I, I may make up for that by doing two on Monday or something like that. So we'll see. So the idea is this. Here, let me, let me I'm going to read the bulleted points off of the printed, of the, isn't that a great graphic? I printed out their website and uh, I'm just going to read the bullet list off here. So every day in November, make a thing. Simple enough, right? Try to make something extra. So if you're the sort of person that, like me, does a lot of 3D printing, try to do something with clay or clay and a stick or, or some medium that you're not used to. I may do some more sewing. I, I will definitely be doing some electronics during this whole thing. Don't take more than a day to do it. And if you've only got five minutes in a day to do it, fine. Use what you have on hand. Limiting your choices makes it easier. So in other words, don't go, ooh, I want to do that thing. I need to order some stuff off Amazon or off, off Adafruit and then wait three months for it. Don't, don't, don't do that. Use what you got. Uh, do it wherever you find yourself. I kind of like this one. I think probably at some point during this, this month, I'm going to make something. If I'm like at a restaurant with a napkin and a straw, I'll figure out something to do. Share it online. This is an important step. If you're on Twitter, if you're on Instagram, whatever, share it online and use the hashtag MakeVember so that we can all find it. If you would like, I have a Discord channel. Hop on, do uh, the What You Making channel, and just say, hey, here's, you know, we'd love to see it. Uh, every day, just make something. That would be really cool. These, these last steps are also important. Be kind to yourself. Okay, it's okay to share something that isn't going to change the world. It's okay to share something that isn't complete. It's also okay to share something that didn't work. You tried, you have something to show for it, put it out there. And lastly, done is good enough. I'll put a link to Dominic's Hackerspace. It's, it's called, uh, what, is, what is the website? Chickengrillis.wordpress.com. It's like Bear Grillis, but chicken. Get it? I thought it was funny. I, uh, this challenge resonated with me because I'm starting to feel like like my gears are starting to grind a little bit. I need to do I need to do this video, but I can't do it until I do this video. I need to do this project, but I can't do it until I have success in this area. I'm I'm tying my hands behind my back and stopping myself from doing things because I feel like I need to finish something else. And and this I'm hoping. It's going to just clear the clear the, the the mental pathways and and get me to to a point where I can maybe even make progress on some of those things that are blocking me. For instance, I need to do another video about Legos, not Legos, about interlocking bricks. But I I can't because I'm not having success with that project. Well, maybe what I need to do is make a video about. This, the progress that I've been making and talk a little bit about the, the progress of trying to make a, interlock, a, a inter, interlocking brick for you guys and the difficulties that I've been having with that. Also, I need to talk a little bit about what I want out of this whole movie. I haven't pushed that the way that I should because I have other videos that I need to push and get done and get out and stuff like that. Well, no more. I don't, I'm, I'm not planning on making a video every day, but if this video gets 2,000 views by the end of the month, I will do a review video about all the projects that I did over the course of November or something like that. But yeah, that's that's the plan. And I hope that you guys, if, if this challenge resonates with you, I hope that you'll take it. I hope that I'll see you on our Discord channel. I hope that I'll see you uh, on 
Twitter or, or wherever else you post these videos. I can't wait to see what you come up with. I know I'm sending this out to you guys a little bit late in the day on November 1st, so you haven't got much time to make your first thing. And for me, this video might be my first thing because it was so difficult to make. And if you want to know more about that, remember, I've always got a link to my blog in the pinned comment in the comments section. So as soon as I'm done here, I'm going to go write that up and go take care of that. But there we go. Uh, make it in November. Make Vember challenge. Uh, I hope to see, I'm going to participate in it. I hope to see you guys participate in it. Good luck with that. And now to the end cards. See those videos right there? I've always got two videos, right? And one of the videos, the top video, is what YouTube recommends to you. So if you want YouTube to decide what you're going to watch, click that video. If you don't, the bottom video is a video that I have decided that I would like you to see. So if you would like to not have YouTube control your life, there is a video for you to tell the YouTube algorithm, up yours, I'm going to go watch something else. Nah, I don't know how it works, but there you go. Enjoy it. I'll catch you guys later. Bye.